Hey, what's going on YouTube? Uh, today we got an unboxing of the Arduino Uno R3 kit from uh, Pawoot on Amazon. This kit ran $31, but you can get the Arduino Uno board from them for $18.50, I do believe. This kit's supposed to contain the Arduino Uno R3. Uh, not the SMD edition, uh, the regular version. A uh, mini breadboard, some jumper wires, a USB cable, and a holder for the breadboard and Arduino. Uh, let's get it open and see how everything came. Packing slip, an envelope inside of an envelope. Here we got the USB cable, mini breadboard, Arduino. whole bunch of jumpers as you can see this is what you get in the, the starter kit from Powoot uh, we got our Arduino Uno uh, hopefully it's revision R3 that's what it said in the item description when I purchased it but there have been a couple of comments left that uh, people getting the SMD edition or the R2 revision uh, so hopefully that's the R3 it's not a big deal either way. I'm not going to actually take the chip off unless I have to. Uh, got a USB cable, a three foot uh, A to B USB cable, a mini breadboard, and there's supposed to be like 110 wa jumper wires here uh, of two different lengths. Uh, they look like pretty nice quality silicone uh, jumper wires. Uh, We'll see. Let's get this Arduino open and see what what revision they actually gave us. All right, one thing I did notice in this kit is that they did not send me the uh, holder for the Arduino and the, the breadboard. That's not a big deal though. Uh, let's take a good look around the box real quick. Nothing really except for branding on the box. So let's get it open see what they gave us. It does have the Made in Italy sticker on it, so hopefully it's uh, not a knockoff. Mm. As you can see, the it's a traditional Arduino, uh, real name brand from Italy, not some knockoff. Very surprised about that. I wasn't expecting to have that. I was kind of thinking it might have been a, a knockoff scenes how cheap it was. It was about six or seven dollars cheaper than this whole kit was about seven dollars cheaper than just the original uh, Arduino by itself from other people. Um, this is the R3 revision. It uses the uh, USB to serial chip instead of uh, so we can have the USB header to program the or power the Arduino from instead of uh, the old serial con interface. Uh, reset buttons up here in the corner on this one instead of down by the chip. Uh, that's pretty much not going to make a difference though once we get some shields on it. After taking a closer look at the uh, breadboard here, it's a nice uh, quality plastic it feels like it's pretty sturdy but I did notice it does have double sided tape on one side for you to attach it to the holder that was supposed to come with the kit that I didn't get 
but you could also put it on a proto shield maybe and it's also a good size to keep beside beside your Arduino size comparison here it's pretty much it's just a tad bit bigger maybe a quarter of an inch bigger not much it's a good addition to go beside it but it won't allow for you to do uh, very very big or very complex circuits because it's so small if you're gonna want to do bigger circuits you're gonna have to get a bigger breadboard but this is this is a good starter board for those of you who have never uh, used Arduino or don't know what Arduino is Arduino is pretty much an open source a development project uh, somebody took the liberty to to build uh, everything you need to run and program a microcontroller on one board and it's come a long way actually since the original Arduino uh, this is just one model they have a uh, Arduino mini and Arduino mega uh, Arduino Pro they got an Arduino for Android developers and you can do a lot of little neat projects with with one of these things uh, actually I'm gonna test it real quick with a a blinky program uh, to get to get this LED right here to turn on this little white spot right by my finger to turn on and blink on and off for me and make sure that that this thing powers up and runs as it should uh, give me a second. I'll be right back after I get the code uploaded and and we'll get her going Now as you can see uh, The Arduino fired right up. I didn't even have to program anything the uh, blinky code was already programmed into the The Arduino only thing I had to do was plug power in by USB the Arduino can be powered by the DC jack here that can be run off of battery or from your wall or the USB um, and this is how I have it hooked up now is through the USB. It has a signal or a on power indicator light here. Uh, the the light that's blinking now is uh, actually hooked up to pin 13. Uh, you can use this LED uh, to indicate anything if you want, instead of having to hook up a, an extra indicator LED on one of your shields or something. Uh, the other two lights that are beside it right here. It's kind of hard to see, but the other two white, um, these things right here, these little white LEDs here, those are the uh, data transfer LEDs, uh, RX and TX. Um, Arduino comes with uh, 14 inputs and outputs, uh, six which are PWM enabled and six which are analog ends now, I know the Arduino may look little and uh, but for those who haven't used it before these are very very powerful powerful little boards and they can do a lot of neat little things uh, you can have a a uh, temperature sensor somewhere and have it display out in uh, what the temperature is in your room or outside or where, wherever you want you can program it and ha they have shields for wireless or Bluetooth uh, you can have it unlock your doors for you if you have a servo motor connected to it uh, you can have it set your alarm for you uh, you can can you can build a robot with it um, I think you can run up to uh, with another shield that goes on top of this uh, a shield is something that connects into these headers here that gives you extra functionality with your Arduino uh, I think they have a shield that has a 16 relay uh, stepper motor controller on it and you can run 16 stepper motors from this one Arduino now you won't be able to power all those motors from this Arduino uh, but you can control them through the Arduino it's a great little uh, beginner's development uh, platform to go with ex just to get your feet wet in controlling microcontrollers and programming and just uh, electrical design period. Uh, 
you should uh, go out and get one. I recommend you go to uh, Pawoot. Uh, I'll put a link in the in the description of where I got this. Uh, it was the whole kit that I got with the jumper wires, the USB cable, the breadboard, and the Arduino Uno R3. Um, it come to like 30, 32 or thirty-three dollars. It's very inexpensive, and you can do a lot of stuff with it. Um, uh, that's going to be it for the Arduino uh, unboxing and overview. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. And I, as always, I thank you for watching my videos. Uh, please uh, rate, comment, and subscribe.